Hello, Global Keys. How are you guys doing? Are you guys doing good? Today, I'm going to share about Psalm 100, 1 to 5. Let me read for you guys. Shout for joy to the Lord or the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before Him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is He who made us, and we are His. We are His people, the sheep of His pasture. Enter His gates with thanksgiving and His courts with praise. Give thanks to Him and praise His name. For the Lord is good and His love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through our generations. Amen. He is good for us. He loves us. He is becoming a good shepherd for us. He gives all the safeness. He protects us. He guides our way for us. But sometimes we difficult to understand how much we are blessed. So, I would like to share one book with you guys. If the world were a village of 100 people, it's very nice book. So, when you have time, maybe you can just buy and read. But let me read a little bit. If the world is only one village and there are only 100 people, 20 are undernourished, one is dying or starvation, while 15 are overweight. Of the world in this village, six people own 59%, all of them from the United States, 74 people own 39%, and 20 people share the remaining 2%. Of the energy of this village, 20 people consume 80%, and 80 people share the remaining 20%. 75 five people have some supply of food and a place to shelter them from the wind and the rain. But 25 do not, 17 have no clean, safe water to drink. If you have money in the bank, money in your wallet, and spare change somewhere around the house, you are among the richest eight. If you have a car, you are among the richest seven. Among the villagers, one has a college education to have computers, 17 cannot read. Isn't it interesting? According to this book, we are own so much things. Maybe through your parents, you have a lot of things. It doesn't mean that who doesn't have is not blessed. God bless everyone in each situation because he's a good shepherd. But why am I sharing this book with you guys? I want you to think about how much we are blessed. Knowing that Jesus Christ is also so much blessed because so many people doesn't know is God. And also we can think about how much we have. Why? Because he wants us to be the channel of blessing through what we have. Because everything what we have is from him. So, after this time, you can talk about this subject with your teacher and friends. How much are you blessed? Have a good time. See you next time. Bye.